Okay, everyone, I'm going to show you how to make a uh, slow mo less nice, flossy smoothness with Twixer and without Twixer. So, this is what it looks like by itself. So, I'm going to add velocity, find a place for it to slow down, and then this is what it looks like with velocity. See how it's kind of laggy and choppy? We are going to make it more smooth, and this is, first way I'm going to show is without Twixter. So what we're going to do is go to Video Bus Track, yeah, click it, thanks, click, and you should see a purple thing down here if you don't, um, to the left, click one of those buttons next to video and it should work. So you're just going to raise it to wherever it looks best. Now with this, it is kind of ghosty but you don't have to download Twixter to get it and it looks better than the very choppy version and yeah so now after we do it without Twixter I'm gonna show you how to do it with Twixter so I'm gonna undo everything out and then get it back to its original video then I'm gonna go to Twixter Pro and these are my settings. I have an uncut B and then I have a background motion sense at 100 and the frames 23.97 because that's the frame rate of the video and then speed at 50. That's basically half the speed rate. So it's going to be slower, smoother, more beautiful. And yeah, so it's with Twixter. You can do it without Twixter. Um, if you want any more. Oh, this is me showing you how to make it look with more velocity so I make put the video back in its original without Twixter. I cut it and then I keep the first one without Twixter and the second one with Twixter so it's like fast and slow like velocity would do except there's no laggy or choppiness. So yeah like I was saying before if you want me to do any more tutorials put it down in the comments below and I will try to do them. Okay thanks.